Hi and welcome to 6 Minute Math. Para sa video na to, aalamin natin kung paano ba kumuha ng product ng functions. In multiplying functions, ang tatandaan lang natin ay f times g of x is equal to f of x times g of x. So in this example, ang una natin munang gagawin ay to define yung function na imumultiply natin. And that is f times g of a is equal to f of a times g of a. Now, substitute natin yung value ni f of a and then g of a. f times g of a now is equal to 2a times quantity 3a squared plus 2a minus 1. Kapag nag-multiply tayo ng monomial, o yung tinatawag nating polynomial with 1 term, sa trinomial, o yung tinatawag nating polynomial with 3 terms, ang ginagawa natin is to distribute. Pag sinabing distribute, ang operation na ginagamit ay multiplication. So, 2a times 3a squared, the answer is 6a cubed. Tandaan na kapag nag-multiply tayo ng variables, ang ginagawa natin sa exponent ay ina-add. Next, 2a times 2a is equal to positive 4a squared. And then, 2a times negative 1 is equal to negative 2a. Tapos na natin i-multiply yung function natin. So, ang gagawin na natin ngayon is to write the final answer. f times g of a is equal now to 6a cubed plus 4a squared minus 2a. For example number 2, find the product of f of a is equal to 2a plus 4 and g of a is equal to 2a minus 1. Again, define natin yung function na kukunha natin ng product, which is f times g of a is equal to f of a times g of a. Now, substitute natin si f of a and g of a. f times g of a now is equal to 2a plus 4 times 2a minus 1. So, dito ang minumultiply naman natin is binomial to binomial. In multiplying binomial to binomial, ang ginagawa natin ay gumagamit tayo ng tinatawag na foil method. Ibig sabihin ng foil method, we multiply the first terms first. Next, yung outer terms naman yung multiply Third is yung inner terms naman. And then yung last is yung last terms naman yung multiply So, paano yun? So, first terms muna. 2a times 2a, we have 4a squared. Outer terms, we have 2a times negative 1. That is negative 2a. Next is inner terms, 4 times 2a, that is 8a. And then last is the last terms, which is 4 times negative 1, that is negative 4. So yung foil method, para lang din tayo nag-distribute. I-distribute muna natin si 2a, 2a times 2a, 2a times negative 1. And then i-distribute naman natin si 4, 4 times 2a, and then 4 times negative 1. After multiplying, combine like terms naman tayo. So, f plus g of a now is equal to 4a squared since 4a squared doesn't have any like terms. Next, pinag-combine natin si 8a and negative 2a since they are like terms. So, 8a minus 2a, the answer is positive 6a. Final answer is 4a squared plus 6a minus 4. And then for the last item, get the product of f of a is equal to 2a plus 4, and g of a is equal to 3a squared plus 2a minus 1. So, the function f plus g of a is equal to f of a times g of a. Then, substitute f times g of a now is equal to 2a plus 4 times the quantity 3a squared plus 2a minus 1. Again, gaya nga nang sinabi ko kanina or yung ginawa natin dun sa binomial to binomial, i-distribute lang natin yung bawat term. So, for this example, si 2a muna. 2a, let's multiply it to 3a squared. 2a times 3a squared, the answer is 6a cubed. Next, 2a times 2a, the answer is 4a squared. Next, 2a times negative 1, the answer is negative 2a. Next, yung second term naman yung i-distribute natin. 4 times 3a squared, that is 12a squared. 4 times 2a, 
that is 8a, and 4 times negative 1, that is negative 4. Next, i-rewrite na natin to final answer yung sagot natin. f times g of a now is equal to 6a cubed plus 16a squared plus 6a minus 4. Saan ang galing si 16a squared? Pinagsama lang natin si 12a squared and then si 4a squared. Saan naman ang galing si 6a? Pinag-combine lang natin si 8a and then si negative 2a. 8a plus negative 2a, the answer is positive 6a. Therefore, our final answer is 6a cubed plus 16a squared plus 6a minus 4.